buy all your willies and Jeep restoration parts at thejeepsterman.com because we're not just Jeepsters anymore. Hey guys, this is uh, John at Jeepsterman. Today we're working on our CJ3B here that we're going to be entering into the uh, Epic Willys race event. So I just wanted to talk about this uh, universal carburetor that we sell and just a little tip for this when doing the installation. Um, obviously this is a F head 134 engine and this this part number for this carburetor is 900001. Um, you can find it on our website but I just want to talk about a couple installation tips for this. So you'll find that on the F head, your linkage won't quite clear. Uh, it would actually be too high on this. And what's cool about these carburetors, you can adjust this arm here. So I moved the arm up some, there's these little pins and you can move this up. However, your linkage up here would still end up hitting the top of the valve cover. So what I did was got a set of vice grips, clipped it right there, and then I bent it down some to line up. And that, that's the idle position. And you can see that we clearly have nice, now you can really see that bend that I had to do right there. So you can see that we've got all the full travel that we need when you press the accelerator pedal down. So just wanted to talk about that little tip there. Now something that I'm gonna do, um, you know, these, these 134 engines, they're notorious for getting vapor lock if you run them for extended periods of time. You know, that heat transfers up from the intake manifold there into your carburetor, it can boil the fuel and then you've got vapor lock. So what I'm doing on this one, cause we're, we're gonna be running this thing for long periods of time during the day. And even for some people like to cruise these on a weekend, you might wanna think about this. So I don't have the part yet, I just ordered it and I'll try to get these things listed on the website, but I just ordered a spacer. So I ordered a quarter inch spacer and a half inch spacer here. It is the correct width that should fit this carburetor. Um, center to center is two and 11 sixteenths. And if we put that spacer in there, it's exactly what it's meant for is to reduce that heat that transfers from the intake manifold to the carburetor. So it should solve that issue and reduce the, you know, the likelihood that we would get vapor lock. So we'll be doing that as well. I just don't have that part here uh, yet for that. We'll do that later. If you got questions or, or you want to check this carburetor out, uh, really, they're, they're nice carburetors. I really like them. And um, you can find these on the website. The website's thejeepsterman.com. You can email us, sales at thejeepsterman.com. Or you can call us, 314-798-6462. Again, the part number on this one is 900-001. Thanks. To get a free copy of the Willys and Jeep Restoration Parts Catalog from the Jeepsterman, go to www.thejeepsterman.com and order your free copy today. <laughs> awesome. Actually, you know what? No, no, no high tech at all. <laughs> That's